In this video, let us see how to get this RDP for free without any credit card using the GitHub code space. Earlier, I made a video about how to get the RDP using the GitHub workflow. If you haven't watched that video, I will provide the link in the description you can send it out. So let's get started. Just go to the github.com, take a new one or use the existing account to log in. And on the top left hand side, you will see a three icon. Click on that and select the code space. Here, click on this new code space to create a new one. This will open up a new page like this. Here we need to select the existing repository of ours. Select anyone. In this case, I'm going to choose this. If you get any message like code space usage for the repository is paid by this user, don't worry, we will not provide any credit card details. And select the Ford code and click on create code space. We will just use the terminal provided by this code space. So we will not use any credit card information here. Just give you a few minutes. As you can see, now it says setting up remote connection. Now we got our terminal. So let me expand this terminal. Here I will provide the link of this Google Drive in the description. You can check that out. Just copy the first command and paste it in the code space terminal. Paste it here. So click on allow to paste the code. Now press enter. It will install the dependencies we need for the RDP. Now it asks us to choose the language for the RDP. Select the English, click on OK. And OK here also and OK. Now the code is successfully executed. Open a new tab and type the remote desktop.google.com. We will use the remote desktop to connect to the RDP that we create on the code space. So this is how the remote desktop will look like. Click on setup via SSH and click on begin and select the next and click on authorize. So just copy this Debian Linux command here. Copy this command and paste it in the terminal. Let me open up the terminal and paste it here. Press enter. It will ask you to enter your pin for the RDP. Remember this pin, when you log into the RDP, this pin will ask for the password. So just enter it and remember it. Now I have set the pin as, as you can see it says host ready to receive connections. Just open the Google Drive sheet and copy this command and paste it here. Let's also copy the remaining command. Let me copy this and paste that here. Let's also copy this command and paste it here. Finally, copy the last command Let's also execute this command. Now we have completed our setup in core space. Let's go to the github.co space. Here click on the three dot on the bottom right corner and select the stop core space. After that, click on your profile in the top right corner and select the settings. Here click on core space. Change the I default idle timeout to 240. So we can use RDP for up to four hours in single day. Save this. So again, click on the three dots at the top left corner and select the core space again. Let's open this core space one more time. Go to the remote desktop and select the remote access. As you can see, it says last online 1254. Just wait for this terminal to load. Then we will get online. As you can see, it says setting remote desktop connection. Just give you a few minutes. After that, we will get your connection in the remote desktop. So you can see it says running. Now refresh this remote desktop page. Now it says online. Click on this. It will connect it to the RTP. Enter the pin that you have set earlier. Now we got successfully connected to this Linux RTP. Let's open the terminal. If you want to see the IP address of this RDP, just type IP call fix. So this is our network information. Let's update our package. 
apt update to install the firefox just type sudo apt install firefox this will install the firefox browser and click on y to install it now we have installed the firefox to run it just type firefox it will open up the firefox browser as you can see we have downloaded the firefox let's check the internet connection by typing the fox.com as you can see we get the speed up to 100 mbps seconds 550 megabytes per second this is our speed let's actually download some software to see the real speed so let me download this as you can see the speed is pretty good 3 megabytes per second I have also I have also installed the Olama in this remote desktop. The response are pretty good. You can see that here. I have installed this Llama 3.1 latest version. You can see that the response are pretty good because we are on the 16 GP of RAM. So let's use the boy command to in this Olama. If you want to terminate this RDP, just go to the GitHub core space and select stop core space. It will stop the core space. If you want to reconnect it, follow the steps that I have mentioned here. This is how to get a remote RDP for free using the GitHub core space.